Okay, so it would seem Facebook doesn't like me this morning and then that nobody can see my live. Even I couldn't see my live. So I figured I would just do a video and post it for you guys. So we're going to start and I've got loads of products here to start to show you. But I'm going to start with my own skin routine this morning because I haven't quite finished it. I've cleansed, but I haven't applied my oil or my C shop. Um, as many of you already know, I do use the distillery range because it is amazing and it smells heavenly. It's literally made from all different kinds of fruits, so it's very vegan friendly. It's it all recyclable. I mean, this is glass and it's recyclable. This is um, a kind of aluminium, I think, um, which again is recyclable. There's literally nothing. And I mean, let's face it, they're really cute pots anyway so you could reuse them so them are the distillery range and they're really simple to use and they've actually got um cucumber in them which i think is amazing sorry the dog was stuck in the fence so we're going to go for the c shot i just literally put that in my hand two shakes Okay, so it's literally like this. And then I'm going to mix this tea shot in. And then we're done. I do like to rub some in, plainly because it just feels weird just dabbing literally it feels weird to dab in so i like to do pat pat in and i just get it all off my hands but it smells it smells lovely and then we're going to go in with the shade of the day um now we don't need a lot of this because it is really movable, it does. So you're literally just using three dots on the cheekbones, two on the forehead, two on the pulse points, and one on the nose. And I'm gonna wipe off the excess because we don't need more than that. And we do, uh, Avon, the recommend you do in the circular motions so you can see it's leaving like a white film across my face now that is literally the sun cream oh sorry the sun cream part of it which obviously helps towards protecting you on hot days now i don't know about you guys but i have been out at the seaside on a hot day with makeup on and i've got home and i have blistered here where sunburn has been really bad and i'm the T zone, isn't it? It's the T zone. Um, and it's been really quite sore for a few days afterwards. So yeah, a lot of makeup products can actually react to the heat on the sun and actually do cause the burning. So a lot of the products nowadays, or at least they're starting to, actually have the SPF in them. So you actually have the protection on your face from the makeup products, which I think is amazing. But that is literally my daily routine. So the, there's so many benefits of having a skincare routine uh, other than obviously the amazingly good skin because the skin is amazingly different. Bloody go find some shoes. So your, your skin is constantly shedding dead skin cells. So like throughout the day, it doesn't matter what you're doing, your skin is always working and it's getting rid of all the dead skin to give the new newer skin chance to be there to shine and glow and look pretty and everybody can say oh you are glowing your skin's amazing but if you don't get rid of all that dead skin by washing your face or cleansing your face it builds up and that is how we get our acne and spots and blackheads and everything else that goes with it so it is important and even for like puberty age to teenagers um i found especially with my my oldest going through stuff 
um, I wanted something more gentler on his skin. I didn't think, I mean, this is very gentle stuff, but I don't want to be paying that price range for my 13 year old, especially considering he's a boy and I have to hold his head over the sink to wash it. So no, I wanted something a little bit easier. So that is why I found this stuff. Now this stuff I used for years, didn't really help me as much as I as this did but it is great for the, the normal kind of skin types. Whereas I am not a normal skin type, I am a sensitive, a very sensitive skin type. Um, this was good, it didn't give me any reactions, but it wasn't as good as it has been for my son. So he, he uses the Nutri FX Minicellular, Minicellular? somebody's gonna have to tell me how to say that one, gel along with the face scrub. Now it does say in a lot of places that I have read not to use face scrubs that are harsh on the skin for teenagers, especially of a sensitive skin because it can irritate it more and it will. this is what leaves you sore and dry and it tight as well. So this is a smooth one um, which is a lot nicer on the skin and it's nicer to actually when it comes to rubbing it isn't as painful. Let me. Ooh. So if I just take a little bit here and show you, so it is a little bit sandy, but the grains are, are big enough to actually hurt. So and you can see, look, it's turning white. So the more that you do it, and the whiter it turns, the more rubbish it's taking off. Yes, I need a shower. <laughs> so that is really, really good. I swear to God, my my son's skin has changed so much. And, and he uses this stuff too. So this is a lightweight face oil. I have my daughter using this also because she has been playing a lot with makeup and I don't want her clogging her pores and her having a lot of skin issues when she's older. Little girls do play with a lot of makeup and she looks like a clown half the time but we love her it's fine so yeah we use this which looks like this i mean this one is nearly gone um this is the kids one they use it when they when they bath or when they wash their face which is twice a day just to get it better you know just to help with the moisture so it goes on dry skin and that is literally all they need that's literally all they need and then they rub it in and it it's amazing for the for the skin and for the spots honestly it has been amazing for my kids and this is what I used before it did clear up most I'll say most of my dry skin but because I have eczema um, and like I say a very sensitive skin I have reactions to almost everything I have ever tried that's got perfume in it. I cannot use perfumed products on my skin. So this NutriFX stuff is amazing. And I didn't have the reactions, but because of my eczema, I would have very dry skin here. And here would be dry. Um, it did ease it, but not as fast as my distillery range, which again, not for the kids, but definitely for the kids. This has been doing amazing for my kids, honestly. Absolutely love it. But doesn't stop him getting some spots. Let's face it. And this stuff, this stuff is my torture device. I love it. I'll explain why, right? So you only put it over the actual patch. You see the nozzle? It's quite thin. Okay, so it literally, let me squeeze a little bit. That's it. That's literally so you use your finger and you're dabbing it on the spot and it stings like a bear. It really, really stings. For a few seconds, you know, give it a bit of a hoo. James, however, more than like eat the faces are amazing. But by the following morning, they are not as red. And this is the clear skin range. So it's not as red and after a couple of days of using them, the spot's completely gone. So like two or three days, the spot is gone. And he is going through that 
all that hormone change and all the joy that comes with it, including the really big spots. Boys are gross. Um, and I didn't want him to be that kid at school. I, did, I really didn't. I remember being at school and there was a lad that used to have a face full of disgusting spots and everybody in the classroom would be like oh don't want to sit next to him it might pop i remember some of the stuff that the kids used to say about that poor lad and i didn't want that for my son i really did not and high school is hard enough for the kids so a skin routine for them as well as the spot stuff has massively helped um and it gives them confidence. It really boosts the confidence when they're feeling good. It makes a whole difference. It really does. So it does make a huge difference on them. I mean, I'm going to try and get him to come into the video just to show you. Come here. Look. Down, 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 down. So this guy had spots really bad. And he's still got a bit of a scar where he's picked some. But his skin has cleared up amazingly. It really has. Um, the spots have gone down. I still have a few blackheads going, but it's fine. You know, he's a teenager. He's going to go through that. I'm on the internet. Not yet, you know. <laughs> but they do use these, uh, you know, the skin routine is important. No matter what your age is, it's not just about the cleanliness. It's about washing off the pollution. It's about giving your face, hands, arms, necks, the chemicals that you would otherwise be missing is keeping that balance so that they're not, you're not greasy, you're not oily, you're not dry. It's natural and it's glowing. And I mean, I can go makeup free now. I can go and I can actually wear makeup. Whereas before, I couldn't because it literally cracked all the time no matter what makeup i used no matter what primer i used it cracked so you know skincare routines i'm all for it now i'm converted we're there but let's move on from the skincare because i don't want to bore you all with it and it is going to be a long video considering how much we've got to get through so i wanted to show you some of the new products so we have two new scents this month well coming up in this next month we have the pure which is a unisex scent um and it, it let me have it it says white musk and bamboo leaves so don't you hate when you can't get into them oh oh that smells that smells nice actually it smells very it's a very light scent if you don't like something that's very overpowering, this is very light. I do like that. I like that. And it's a unisex scent, so you can use it too, I suppose. And this is the Marine Sea Salt and Driftwood Shower Gel. This is a darker blue. These are the bigger bottles, I'll just show you. So these are the bigger ones. That's the smaller one. That's the 250 milliliter. That's the 500 milliliter. Um, and the, like I say, these are the new scents that have been released. They're hard to get into. Hmm. I don't know what... <laughs> I don't know what that smells like. It's definitely stronger than this one. But it's still a nice smell. And this says... with the, It's 100% natural, is this? So these are 100% natural. Oh, both of them are. Look at that. Can you see? 100% natural. Awesome, right? So them, them are the new scents coming to the bath range. They will also be a bubble bath that comes out in the pure. Um, and a hand wash. The hand wash also comes out. And this is, this is the marine one. But I believe they is a pure one too. Which is great, especially for right now. Um... We're moving on to the next one, which is my favourite meal. So I have a lot of you guys who like the Far Away. This is the new released Diva, which will be available from the first. So you can pre-order yours now if you wish. I am more than happy to put the pre-order in. 
I will put the order in on the first. Um, I'm not going to open them, but I can have a bit of a smell of this one because this, let's have a look. Oh no, she can't get into it. Let me see. Right, so, ooh. So it's a spicy scent. Let me smell. Let me see. Keep away from heat and out of the way of children. Really? Well, it doesn't tell you what the scent is made out of. So that's an awesome one, right? Hmm. So my best way to describe it to you is spicy it is like spices it's it's quite nice it's definitely one of those that would last all day and you'd still be smelling it when you went to bed you know and you would not need a lot of this honestly you would not need a lot um so this is the new fire away diva because we're all a little diva really and that's the perfume and the body lotion to get the longer lasting scents I would say use the lotion and then the perfume because then it lingers longer you've got more of the so there's three stages to a scent you have the and the heart scent the middle one is the one that lasts the longest and with the body lotion as well you would it would last even longer so you know it's always good to get your favorite scent in the body lotion too so that's that one and i'm going dead hang on i have a dead leg dead leg let me just alter that okay so my next one i'm so excited about because there's three of them so primers i've always been a big thing right they have and um, but they have never been primers for oily skin dry skin or normal skin before you always have to mix and match and pray to god it works whereas these ones we have finally finally got three different ones so this is the hydrate one so if you have dry skin a primer will actually work now and it will cover it whereas before doesn't matter how much primer you put on that was that was cracking and the oily one hang on I just wrong out one let me get that one so this is for oily and shiny skin or oh, the problem with oily and shiny skin is when you put makeup on it comes away a lot faster because the oil literally just makes it slither down the face it's just not gonna stick it doesn't stick very good whereas this this works amazingly let me just show you so it's a clear substance when it's on see how it's just a little bit white let me just get that little bit okay so it's literally clear look at that it's it's smells really nice too so it doesn't actually have that smell like the other one did mm, that's nice so this is gonna lock in with the moisture in your face it's gonna it's gonna sort of settle the balance so that when you put the foundation on it's not gonna melt away as the day goes on you're not gonna have to reapply as much as what you would normally do because that is the job of the primer and then we have the normal skin type what's normal i don't know what normal is but this is a smoothing spf 20 primer so this is the one that i would now use because my skin t my skin now is not dry and it's not oily because of the skincare routine that i do use so if I wanted to prime as well, this would be what I would use. So this is supposed to blur the lines. Um, so let's just have a look. Oh, it does. Okay. Crow's feet. Bye-bye. 
That's a pretty good one, isn't it, really? Okay, so... See if you can tell the difference. So, primed, not primed. Can you see? Quite impressed. It's the first time I've actually had to play with them because I was waiting to show you guys. And these will all be available from the, from the first. Again, I can pre-order them if you wish. Oh, I don't know where to, let's have a look. What's this one like? My lefter lines are very deep. I think there's even a difference there, look. Okay, so that's that you can see the difference. So primer, not primer. And it feels really smooth. And I don't know whether you've actually watched any of my videos beforehand. Um, and you've noticed that when I've used the white the white primer, I've struggled to breathe around it because I'm very sensitive with stuff like that. And um, because it does actually have a tin of um perfume in the, the white one the original whereas this one doesn't um there's no can't breathe you know there's none of that now but yeah the difference look at the difference literally half and half so yeah that's the new primers the next one i wanted to show you is the power stay eyeshadows let me turn that around there we go there we go that way that way so i'm going to show you what these are like because i'm going to just prime might as well stick with the one eye had not i let's just prime the eye this is the magic eye primer okay so you can see the difference look not primed i'm going to leave this side so you can see the difference and this is primed and I've, I've just used my finger, literally, because, well, there's not much other way you're going to get it out of there. Let's face it. It's tiny. Look at that. So, we are going to use, we have two shapes. Ooh. We have this, this one, which is Everyday Beige. And then we have this one, which is... Statement Berry. So we're going to give it a go. So these actually blend. These are blendable products. And they're not smudgeable once they're on, obviously. Once you've finished um, getting everything on, it's not it's not smudgeable, which I must admit, I did touch my eye, touch my eyes a lot. And the other day when I tried the statement one, I was really surprised I didn't have it across my face because I had an itchy eye and I forgot that I was using a soft brush and I just went like that. And I was like, uh, but it didn't, it didn't, my eyes were fine. <laughs> so I'm just gonna, let's have a look. I want you to see the colors. Um, Let's okay, so I don't it's not the best color, is it? Let me change my light. See if that changes the Nope. Nope. No, nope, not working. Okay, not working. So I'm not right bothered about how it looks a minute because I will be taking it off after the video. I just want you to see the colour. So this is the colour on this one. It's definitely going to make a statement, that's for sure. Look at that purple. Okay, so I know it's a mess. I just wanted to show you how easy they go on. And they do blend. Let me... I don't have... I do, because they're here. Oh, 
Okay, let me. They blend pretty well, actually. So that's. And you can actually go underneath the eye with them, so you can actually use them as an eye pencil. Um, not that I've tried it, but we'll give it a go. Now I look like I have, but it is actually on the eyelid. Not the eyelid, the, um, it is there. So you can see, look, there's the beige on top and then the purple. Pretty good, right? I feel like I need to finish it off now. Hang on. Um, use this one. Use this one just to finish it off so that you can see the effect properly. I'm sorry, I'm using you as my mirror. So that is the power stay and it's not going to go anywhere it's really not so that's with the primer and the eye primer without primer and bear in mind I have no foundation on so I haven't applied any foundation this morning um, so this would cover these this will all cover um, which is pretty good right shall we do that Ooh, let me fish it out. Let's fish it out. Just gonna waste a couple of products, you know, who cares? Just so you can see the difference with the primer. So that is officially half and half. How about that then? Quite impressed with it myself. Hope you guys are too. So without further ado, let's do the sunglasses reveal. So we did a raffle for the sunglasses and I have all of your numbers and names and names just so that I didn't get lost in here and um, we're going to draw a winner for that but I know this is a long video but bear with me guys I wanted to also show you what we have so far in the wild win so everybody who has ordered through me this month over the value of 10 pounds will win everything in this box which includes a detangling spray and a treatment spray treatment spray treatment mask for the hair shampoo a jelly lip and cheek tint which are about six pounds we have also got a glimmer stick we have a sweet maple lip gloss which is a brown type of one we have a face mask and a makeup bag really pretty makeup bag there look guys and this week's product to go in we i will put up to vote in so you can all vote it vote it in actually there's a lipstick missing from this jar that's because it's up there but there's also a lipstick in there that's um wine with everything i believe is the color 
so that is still up for grabs this month if you have not already ordered and you want to be in for the win for the wild win then an order of 10 pound that's all you need to put in it's amazing the products that we're obviously obviously are the value of more than the 10 pound anyway at the moment it stands at about 32 pounds worth and it keeps going up so you know gotta be in it to win it now then guys the sunglasses which are amazing let's have a look who's gonna be our winner <laughs> number two jennifer heard congratulations you have won the sunglasses i will be in touch with you and let you know when i will deliver because they are here they're just on my shelf okay guys it's been really nice for you to watch my video i'm sorry i couldn't go live for whatever reason facebook is having an issue but i hope you enjoy the video sorry it's so long